Nigeria has a population of 140 million people. There is a vision of universal basic education for all 70 million children in Nigeria. But this is a huge challenge. After decades of neglect, the education system is in crisis. But there is progress. These are the stories of three schools trying to give their children the education they deserve. From Kujama Primary School in Chikun to Apostolic Primary School in Ofa and Chirumawa Junior Secondary School in Garumalam. These are the stories of Nigeria School. In Kaduna State, there are schools of very different quality. Some, like the Kaduna Capital Government School, are excellent, while others, particularly in the rural areas, are in terrible condition. This is a story of just one rural school and the challenges it faces. This is Kujama in Chikun LGA of Kaduna State. Blessing Adamu is five years old and lives with her auntie Maria and cousin Nana. I like and yam. What of blessing by a matwamba banta? Senagaya ras when your mama may you are. Nagamba you may choke the zona hakaba. Nagaya choke it amate makaranta. But Maria was determined to get an education. Now Maria is training to be a teacher and Blessing is enrolled for her first year of primary education. This is Kujama II Primary School. Blessing is one of over 1,000 pupils. Her teacher is Mrs. Hamatu John. Say, I am Master Usman. I am Master Usman. I say you should mention your own name. If you are blessed, you say blessing. Do you get it? Yes. If you are savior, you are just, just say savior. Just mention your own name. Do you get it? Yes. Say, I am Master Usman. I am Master Usman. Despite the confusion, Blessing is trying her best. Then Blessing answer him. I am Mr. Blessing. I am Miss Blessing. Over half of primary school teachers in Nigeria are not properly qualified. For head teacher Mrs. Bihatu Yabiwat, this lack of qualified teachers and the complicated way in which teachers are recruited are a serious concern. So the major problem presently is lack of enough teachers. We requested about 15 to 16 teachers. They kept us promise they will bring, they will bring, but anyway, we are waiting for them, sir. We are waiting, we are still waiting. Mrs. Yabiwat has other concerns. Geya Haruna is her assistant head teacher. He is riding to the nearby nomadic school which he runs. These schools are being established in Nigeria to give nomadic communities like the Fulani better access to education. But the lack of basic equipment is a big problem. Amadu Abdullahi is a Fulani farmer. His three daughters and son attend the school. <laughs> At Kujama 2, primary six are going to the library. In the free lesson, you can create time if there is not any assignment and classwork that is given to you. You come down to the library and pick one or two books to help yourself in further learning. Are you getting me? Yes. It's very, very important because it helps our children to learn how to read. And they are reading now, especially from class 4 to 6.
Nasu dan zama chama na lokal gama zan yi makaranta kuma makarantu ne ara wanda ba su da yayya ka Sadiq is one of hundreds of children who are paralyzed each year in Nigeria by preventable diseases da ina da kafa da ni ma shi in buga kwallo Kujama too are in training for the local derby match against Magashanu. Friday Amadu is the team's so coach. You make sure you train well as I've been training you before. Sadiq's friend Lawrence Adams is one of the school's star players. I have been asked to ask my children to follow me to the bank so that they can see me on TV. So I can see them quickly. I came here every rainy season so that we can have food and have food to eat. Lawrence's mother, Victoria Adamo, sells some of their food in the market. I have been to the bank for a school. Ibrahim Ango is chairman of the school's Parent Teachers Association. He has come to see Mrs. Bill Hatu about the challenges she is facing. The local government has built three new classrooms, but Mrs. Bill Hatu can't use them. The local government has built In primary one, Blessing and her 60 classmates are learning how to count. We have on the table, yes, yes, yes. Very good, clap for her. There is a new community initiative to build four classrooms. The builders need rocks to complete the floor. So with the support of parents and teachers, after school, the children go to the quarry to collect rocks, helping to improve their own school environment. The school holidays are almost over. It's time for Sadiq and his friends to prepare for the final term. His father is hoping for the best for his young son. The lady in the sun is also a macaranton, so what a local tea as soon as a money. You know, the chow, Cassayar and Macaranta, yes, I'm more me. So what a chigawa, the Allah Bada and Saga Macaratin, and Allah was Aichi, Jesu Aichi, the Mente Macon Cassan Suma. Teacher Mrs. Yabiwat, the new term has not brought any solutions to her lack of supplies and teachers. At the nomadic school, Geya Haruna is teaching English. Audu and Sarah of Team Travel, they like going to big boy, big cities. 
Kenya has written a letter to the local government education secretary. Sir, letter of request. On behalf of the Parent Teachers Association of the above named school, write to inform the authority that the school need, need your assistance of the following items because the school is yet to develop so that the Fulani will be encouraged to send their children to the school. So, this is a letter from your school. Oh, request, yes, sir. You have listed various requests here. Yes. You want a exercise book. You need additional teachers. Really? I need you also need additional teachers. I'm only... You teacher. also require construction of classes. How many? Four. You require four classrooms in that school. No, the other issues, like the building of classroom, like the provision of uh, books, these ones are things that the government have to do. And even uniform. Already the Kaduna State Government has taken over the supply of uniform to our primary school people. Only that it has not gotten to their turn, but it will reach their turn. Okay, and I believe by the time their turn comes, all the peoples in that schools will be supplied with uniform. I submitted a written document here to them to assist. But there was no any response. This time, as I assume, they may likely assist, according to the statement they made. As a teacher without a single desk in his school, he is determined to bring about change. It will happen. <laughs> it will happen. I have that belief. There have been some changes at Blessings House. And she has learned to count. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That eight. Mama, I'm going to make a letter. What does this one require? I'm going to make a letter. I'm going to make a English social studies, mathematics, health education, primary science. I'm going to make a letter. For Blessing and her auntie, this year has transformed their lives. While Siddiq dreams of going to secondary school, Mrs. Yabiwat fights on in her battle for more and better qualified teachers. For the Lomadic School, nothing has changed, but they are still determined to succeed. And for Lawrence, his big day has arrived. It's the local derby against Magashanu. The main team are going to beat their opponents because they have their confidence. I'm having the confidence of that due to the way I trained them. And the coach Ready? has high expectations of Lawrence. The by is Lawrence. They are going to beat this. And the final score. 4-1 to Kujama Primary. Tomorrow on Nigeria School. We go to Chiromawa Junior Secondary School in Kano, where Nafisa Ahasan is determined to complete her education. <laughs> Come on, I can't. I'm not saying 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 I'